I wanted to go over the, with this with you so you have an idea of what to expect when you're either arriving into the Philippines or departing from the Philippines. Stay tuned. This is Life in the Philippines. Breaking news alert. Hello guys, this is Bobby D coming to you from the Long Bond City Philippines. Having an awesome time in the Philippines today. Hope you are as well where you're from. Hey, today I want to talk to you about the Philippines arrival and departure guide. So thank you for being here and I would suggest you click on the subscribe button and the bell notification so you continue seeing fresh new Philippine videos, motivational videos, and worldwide videos. There's been so much um, change with the Bureau of Immigration and the policies and procedures. It just came out with a revised advisory for guide, a guidelines for entering, arrival, and departure from the Philippines. I wanted to go over the, with this with you so you have an idea of what to expect when you're either arriving into the Philippines or departing from the Philippines. These are new changes that the Bureau of Immigration has just made. I'm going to try to enlarge my screen just a little bit. As you can see, the rise revised advisory there. I'm going to try to enlarge it a little bit so you can follow me as we go through this guideline. Here we go. Now, as you can see, passengers allowed to travel to the Philippines per the BI advisory dated January 20th. This is an arrival guideline, okay? This is, these passengers are allowed to enter the Philippines without a DFA or authorization exemption, okay? Department of Foreign Affairs offered authorization exemption. Number one, you have the 90 visa holders, okay? This is the diplomatic visa holders. Number two, foreign airline crews. The uh, 9C visa holders, uh, foreign seafarers, that's the seamen, 9D visa holders, foreign investors, uh, Section 13 series, Commonwealth Act, uh, those are your 13C, 13D, 13E, 13G, 13A, and 13B, those are like permanent resident visas. The RA7919 visa, visa holders, uh, that's the Social Integration Act of 1995. Run like the wind, be a king or a queen. Life in the Philippines. 